Complete beginners are making thousands of dollars selling digital products right now. And it's finally time that you got yourself a piece of this growing pie. Because today I'm gonna reveal the top three digital products that I would be selling right now if I were a complete beginner. And as someone who has made over $6 million selling different types of digital products, I think number three has some insane potential right now. And lucky for you, I'm not just gonna talk out of my ass in this video. I'm gonna be building these products live right in front of you. And if you watch this video to the end, I'm gonna reveal to you a special gift that will make everything 10 times easier for you. Product number one is a personal budget tracker. In a world where Google and Apple Pay has made spending absurdly easy for all of us, people are having an increasingly difficult time managing their finances. Myself included, I mean, I'd be ordering Uber Eats like literally every single night. But I mean, think about it. The average American has no clue how much they're currently spending per month on subscriptions alone. Netflix, Spotify, gym membership, food delivery apps, it all adds up to hundreds, if not thousands a month. They know they need to track their budget, but Excel spreadsheets for most people are just confusing, complicated, and not really something that you want to do on a day-to-day -day basis. This is where a personal budget tracker can work its magic. And the beautiful part of selling this type of a digital product is the value is communicated almost instantly. It's a very simple and logical decision in a buying frame of mind to go ahead and purchase this. The market is proven for it and literally everybody needs it. Now I've already done the research for you, but there are thousands of budgeting apps making millions of dollars a year. YNAB or or you need a budget is literally raking in a hundred million dollars annually. So taking a small slither of that massive pie and making just five or ten thousand dollars a month is completely reasonable by creating a digital product in this field that you can literally spin up in minutes. Now in previous YouTube videos I've been giving you guys a lot of theory so in this video I'm gonna actually do the process of creating this type of a product for you. So the first thing that I did is I had to rank and assess all the different tools out there that allow you to build digital products quick and easily. And this tool called Hostinger Horizons, it blew my mind. Let me show you what it can do. So firstly, I built this document so we can actually prompt the AI correctly and have it build exactly what we need. And don't worry, I'll be giving you guys all the prompts that I'm using for free, but we'll touch on that later on in the video. So as you can see, product number one, the personal budget tracker, the first prompt is here. So all we have to do is copy and paste this entire prompt into the Hostinger Horizons builder. And why this works so well is it solves the immediate problem of budget tracking without complex financial planning features. It's simple enough for anyone to use, but comprehensive enough to provide real value. And yes, we can include the why this works into the builder as well, just to give it even more context. But as you can see, this prompt really isn't anything crazy. I'm literally just telling it to create a personal budget tracker web application with the following features. And then all I've done is I've listed all the different types of features that we would want inside of a personal budget plan. Now, of course, I did my research on other products that are working out there in the market and doing millions and millions of dollars a year to come up with the most important features that I've listed on this prompt. Now, inside of Posting or Horizons, literally just a paste and then hit this little blue button on the bottom right. And the interface is very similar to ChatGPT. You have your little prompting tab on the left side here. And then on the right side, it's gonna go ahead and do all the coding and all the work for you. As you can see, it's walking us through what it's doing right now. Step one, it's building a sleek professional interface with modern blue and green vibes. Now, of course, you can also change anything that you don't like before and after. So if you realize you kind of want the colors to be something different or you want it to look a different way, uh, it's very easy to do that inside of here. Just as you would with ChatGPT. And it's gonna go ahead and create a comprehensive budget setup and expense tracking features. It's gonna add a dynamic dashboard with progress bars and visual indicators. And it's gonna go ahead and implement local storage for persistent data between sessions, which basically means that the app will remember all of its previously inputted data so that you can actually use it on a day-to-day -day basis. And guys, take a look at this. In literally like two or three minutes, it has a full app build out. This is, this is insane. All done, your personal budget tracker is ready with a stunning blue and green design and all the features you requested. Let me know if you'd like any adjustments. So again, if you wanna change anything about the current application, the interface, the features, et cetera, you can just add to the pre-existing prompt I gave you right here on the left side. But on the right side, you can see the full app and how it works. So the main dashboard you're gonna see when you open it is your monthly income, the total budgeted, the total amount of money spent, and your current remaining budget. Now inside of the budget tab is where you can actually input these fields. So for example, my monthly income is $10,000 a month. I spend 
$1,000 a month on rent. I spend $1,000 a month on food. I spend $500 a month on transportation, et cetera, et cetera. And I go ahead and update that in my budget planner. And then in terms of expenses, same idea. I can easily go in daily and log all of my different expenses. And we've even included a goals tab for savings targets and things like that. And when you go ahead and start adding to your personal budget tracker daily, it's gonna automatically populate on your dashboard so you can see everything at a glance and you can see your budget versus your actual spending. Now, this is just the tip of the iceberg with how far you can take this, but right away, it's so much easier, it's so much more efficient than using a Google spreadsheet or an Excel spreadsheet and having to constantly pretend you're some financial expert every single day. And the best part of all of this is when we're happy with our final product, we literally, we just have to go ahead and click publish and Hostinger will take care of the rest for us. You can see it automatically sets you up with a free domain, so your app is actually hosted live and ready to be used, but of course, if you want to buy your own domain and connect it separately, you can do that in just a couple clicks right here as well. And yes, it automatically optimizes SEO for you as well. So once you start getting users, it has a chance of showing up higher and higher in Google rankings and people can come and use your product organically. With Horizons, it's also super easy to set up user authentication because they're partnered with Superbase. So your clients can actually have a login and authentication process to use your product provided. You can then monetize it by adding payment processing platforms like Stripe, enable payment options like membership-based payments for monthly recurring revenue or just one-time purchases. This way, your clients can log in, pay, and start using the product immediately. Now, let's briefly touch on how do you actually go ahead and start making sales on your new product. The best way to do it is with micro-influencer partnerships. There are quite literally thousands of finance creators out there that spend all their time creating content and don't really have any way to make money on the back end with their growing audience. This is where you could come in and offer to give them a percentage of all the sales that they bring in by promoting your product and create a true win-win scenario. Of course, you could try going the paid ads route, you could build your personal brand as well, but I've seen right now with AI digital products, micro influencer partnerships are the fastest and easiest way to start making sales. When you start reaching out though, don't get discouraged, it's all numbers. Aim for about 30 to 50 outreaches every single day and over time, you'll start to make sales on autopilot. Now I'm not just talking out of my ass either. I recently helped my girlfriend build a digital product and in a couple of stories, she made hundreds of sales and thousands of dollars from literally one day's work of setting up the entire product and then promoting it to a pre-existing audience. Now let's move on to product number two, an AI flashcard generator. Look, a lot of students are expected to memorize mountains of information in very little time before their exams. You spend over 12 years in school, over four years in college, but nobody teaches you the science behind memorization and actually retaining information. Students often default to the least effective way of remembering information for the test rereading notes, highlighting everything, and cramming last night before the exam. It's proven that one of the most effective strategies to getting results in school is by using flashcards. There is one problem though. Making flashcards is usually extremely time intensive and tedious, and no one wants to do that shit when they have a big exam coming up. But if they could have an AI flashcard generator that automatically compiles the most important pieces of information and turns them into flashcards a thousand times faster, this would be an extremely effective and useful product for any student. I mean, hell, I would have bought this when I was in university just a couple years ago. And again, I've done the research. There are a handful of different applications, websites, and companies such as Acne that are literally making millions of dollars a year with AI flashcard generators. But there is a way to get a massive edge on the pre-existing competition here and market what they're missing. I'll show you what I mean in just a minute, but first let's build the product. So you know the drill now guys, scrolling down to product number two, the smart flashcard generator. Literally all we're gonna do is copy and paste all this information right here, head back over to the beautiful application, paste that in and give it a couple minutes to work its magic. And just like that guys, look at this absolutely useful and beautiful product right here. All you have to do is enter the topic to study or paste your entire study material as much or as little as you want. You can go ahead and select the subject category to give it even more information and click generate flashcards. On top of that, you can even save your pre-existing flashcard sets within the application so you can come back and access them whenever you want. And we've actually prompted it with a built-in feature to ensure that once you start studying, it'll show you how much of the current content you're mastering 
based on your speed and your ability to get the answers correct. Now, let me tell you the little thing that I thought about that could give you a massive edge over the existing AI flashcard generating apps out there right now. So because Hostinger Horizons makes it literally that easy to edit and customize your app or website to your liking, you could start creating branded AI flashcard generators depending on the school or institution that your clients go to. These institutions have insane budgets to spend on products and softwares like these. And if you brand them to match the school that they are selling to, for example, Harvard Business School, and you uploaded all of the material from different courses and you branded it and you included their logo, et cetera, not only would it become a more specific target market and make it more likely that Harvard Business School students, which there are thousands of them, could actually buy your product, you could even reach out to the school and see if you could come in and promote it to the students or form some type of agreement where they're making money on every single flashcard generator that you sell to each one of their students. Now let's move on to the last product, which is my personal favorite and what I think will hit the hardest right now. A restaurant reservation website. Now it sounds basic, but hear me out. There are over 660,000 restaurants operating day in and day out in the US alone. But there's a massive gap in the market here because only 15% of these restaurants currently use the big reservation apps like OpenTable. That means 561,000 restaurants are still doing this shit manually and taking reservations over the phone day in and day out. On top of that, these restaurants are losing thousands of dollars in income that they could be making by having a way for people to book in a table simply by using a website. Think about it. Every single time that someone calls in during a dinner rush to make a reservation, either the phone doesn't get picked up or if it does, it's interrupting their level of service. Handwritten reservation books get extremely messy pages get lost and there's no backup or saved logs of any of that client information which would be useful later down the line for email lists and special events and things like that. And all these restaurant owners, they want to take reservations online, but they can't justify spending thousands of dollars a month on fancy tools and complex systems that they might even not know how to use correctly. They just need something stupid simple that lets customers book their tables in. And that's where our simple and professional restaurant reservation business builder will come in handy. Let's go ahead and build this out. By now you guys are a pro with how this works. So I'm just going to go ahead and copy and paste it straight back in. All right, guys, literally three minutes went by. This is crazy. For this one, we built out the prompt a little bit more than the previous two. But look at this restaurant name, image of the restaurant, you know, headline. Uh, it'll show you the customer view or the admin dashboard, depending on how you look at it. Right now we're on the customer view. Make a reservation in one simple click. The simplest easiest, most seamless experience I've seen. I mean, I would personally like to book in my reservations using a website like this as well. And I think it'd be very easy to sell local restaurant owners on this. All you have to do is select your date, select your time, your party size, and it'll pop up and see if that time is available. You then fill out your contact information and special requests. And just like that, you can confirm your reservation. On top of that, we added an additional feature that shows the signature menu, the price, as well as the ratings of different courses that are offered at the restaurant, an interactive map to get there, email information. Like this is beyond just a basic website. Like this has functionalities that every restaurant needs. And if you know local restaurants in your area that don't have a website or don't have a big presence, presence or any information like this, you could not only sell this as a reservation tool, but as an entire website for their restaurant. On the admin dashboard, you can see the total reservations, how many have been confirmed today, no shows, capacity. You can keep track of all the reservations in a calendar. You can even view advanced analytics inside of your website and adjust the settings here. And again, this is just the beginning of what you can do inside of Horizons. And selling these websites is extremely easy. The first thing you have to do is find restaurants that don't already have websites or websites with these kind of functionalities. You can do this by opening up Google Maps, finding a big city or starting local in your own small town and click restaurants at the top and start searching. Once you find a restaurant that doesn't have a good website presence, you literally just pick up the phone and call their number, pitch them your offer and highlight the benefits of your service. You can easily get one of these websites that you built in minutes to 
to sell for two to three thousand dollars. When I was 18 years old, I would sell websites on Shopify that I would build by hand that took me 12 hours and I'd sell them for two to three thousand dollars. I'd scrape Craigslist for people looking at websites. I'd call any local businesses, including restaurants. And it honestly blows my mind how easy it is to do this today and how fast you can actually create the product and deliver it. If you dial in an outreach process and you reach out to 30 to 50 restaurants a day, you could be making thousands of dollars a day, literally starting tomorrow by using this method. But at the end of the day, guys, information is nothing without action. So remember, these are the next few steps that you should be taking right now to act on this information while the opportunity is still hot and available. First, it's time to redeem your special gift by going into the description. And don't worry, I'm not trying to sell you a course or take any information from you. I'm literally just giving you these prompt packs for 100% free. Second, you need to get Hostinger Horizons, which I'll also have a link in the description with a unique discount code for you to get access with. Use the code NATHAN in all caps to get 10% off your first month in subscription. Or if you buy the yearly plan, you'll also get a domain and hosting for completely free. Step three, copy and paste the prompt packs, add your own spin on it, talk back and forth with the AI for a bit and just start building. Now, if you're already making some good money online, you're an industry expert or an authority, I know this video may have seemed a little too beginner friendly or basic for you, but that's why I'm posting other guides like this one that walk you through in depth how to start other types of digital products. So go ahead and watch that video next. Take advantage of all the free resources in the description and I'll see you soon. Peace.